Hanging out with Greg Byrosh, guy I know pretty well from well, way back in the day, it was uh, Hot Wings TV. Him and myself yeah. and Rich Vleck and Mickey <laughs> used to put together a TV show between the four of us. Those Greg, were some you, interesting road trips, right? They were. A lot of interesting <laughs> conversations as we went around. I remember we hit a cat somewhere on the way back from oh, Mohawk. I yeah. think just jumped out of nowhere, I remember. and. When that, yeah, when well, you know you're coming home at four in the morning or so, yeah. <laughs> you'll have that. At 37, yeah. it's pretty dark. With yeah, 37 is pretty dark yeah. uh, that time of night. So we had, got a lot of stories that, that Greg could, that I could tell, but we're not going to do that tonight. We're just going to talk yeah, about we'll his race. For... We're here at Outlaw tonight. Remember, like, subscribe, and share all this stuff with your friends. Tell me, you're coming off a good run. Uh, yeah, we picked up the top five last week. Had a had a strong run. Um, been struggling a little bit the first two first two nights. Of, the first night we just kind of missed it and you know we had a, a bad draw and then just never went anywhere we were just right. kind of in the back the, the whole night and then uh same thing the second week it had a had a bad draw but then thought we were going to be halfway decent and got together with another car on lap two and broke the rear end and <laughs> you know wow, so, well, those nights. so the first two first two weeks were a little tough but yeah top five last week and been been really happy with how it's performed. I'm sure that money helped because those first two weeks were probably expensive too, <laughs> weren't they? Rear ends aren't cheap nowadays, no. last I knew. So. No, well, luckily we had we had a spare one in the corner, and uh, we were able to put that in. And the one that, that was in it, we'll we'll get it fixed here okay. soon, and then that'll rotate into being the spare one, I think. But. Tell me about the car. So this is this is the same car we've been running since uh, 2016. Uh, it's a 2012 Troyer that. Uh, we got from Mike Mahaney, and we ended up putting a front clip on it ourselves. Changed a couple little things around, you know, just the way we like to have them. But it's, for the most part, it's pretty standard. I, we're one of the last ones that hasn't switched over to all this oh, new left side bars pattern. And everything, huh? We're still on okay. the right side. We're still on the bars. And, and you know, here, especially if this place is, is going to be pretty tacky and grippy like it's been the first three weeks, i I think we're uh, we're actually a little bit better with this okay. deal, but okay. um, you know, well, the, as the season goes, we'll see if we, you know. If yeah, it, I was just going to ask, are you thinking about it? Then oh, you're yeah. obviously researching it, right? Sure, sure, sure. Yeah, we've got, you know, we have a plan if we think we need to go that way. Mm -hmm. But as of right now, we're we're kind of sticking with what works, and okay. you know, we only run, we just run once a week here, and right. so that's all we got to worry about. We're well, not legal on the dirt tour with this particular engine combination, right? No, well, this is this is a big small block, so right. this isn't yeah, a no. this isn't a dirt dirt yeah. car deal. Mm -hmm. um, you know, it it would be nice. It would, you know, we just mm -hmm. would wish they would kind of open that up because, you know, I get frankly, it these I... are these are you know as much power and they're a lot less expensive than the big block. True. So, you know, it would be nice if they do. I think they get a lot more cars if they would do that. Yeah. But but I remember when know, they were allowing that for a while. There were certain tracks. Where yeah. if you had that big small block, it was a huge advantage. Oh yeah, I, I would expect if it was allowed, most everybody would gravitate that way, mm -hmm. which, like I said, is not necessarily a bad thing. Just because, number one, these engines are they're popular in divisions all across the country. Mm -hmm. So you got builders all over that build them. Right. And there, uh, there's a, so there's a market for them. There's a market to sell used ones. There's a market to buy used ones. Um, you know, it just, it seems like it makes a lot more sense. That's part of what, that's really the reason we run here. You know, I mean, it's the same distance from the shop to come here or to go to Canada on a Saturday. Okay. And we run here because it's, the engine package is so much more economical. So. I remember it was somebody with the series. I asked them that question about the time that happened. And they said, well, there's something about getting a big block to work on a slick third mile track, a big old heavy big block. So you want right. everybody on the same playing field, I guess you could yeah. say. Yeah, I get that, and that, right? Right. Yeah, no, it's 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 a double edged sword it for is, sure. Totally is. Maybe even a third edge. Who knows? Yeah. You know? <laughs> <laughs> right. But yeah, there's there's a lot of places where you you know, yeah, you make the big block obsolete mm -hmm. right right from the start. But mm -hmm. you know, that's And of course you're a Byrosh, so last question before we go, so it's gotta be a Ford. It is a Ford, yep. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Did you watch Ford yeah. versus Ferrari? I did. Yeah. Yeah, I did. Excellent I like the scene movie. where uh, I love that. he takes him out in it. I had no idea. Remember? <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> he scares the crap out of him. Because Mr. Ford's like, anybody yeah. could drive a race car, right? right? Sure, Pretty yeah. much, right? But 
yeah. as you know, that is not the case. No. <laughs> so you're happy everything's good? No. Life's good? Yeah. Good. Yeah. Things are going well. Yeah. I'm happy for you. Yeah. Remember, guys, subscribe. Hit the red button, uh, depending on what you're watching. And, uh, Greg, you're going to subscribe when you get home. You're going to keep up on all this, right? Sounds good. All right. Share the stuff, it. and uh, guys will be doing a lot this year. Good to see you, man. I'm doing Victory yeah. Lane, so maybe I'll see you later tonight. I hope so. Greg Thanks, Byrush Doug. with the big small block forward, ready to have some fun here at Outlaw Tonight.